Well, good day, awesome folks. This is Awesome here, and I'm bringing you a live Pokemon X and my Wi Fi battle. Uh, I might sound a little bit more poptastic today because just as I hit the record button, just as my opponent challenged me, my pop guard fell off. So I don't have time to put that back on right now. Uh, so, yeah, there may be a bit more noises than usual. So I apologize in advance for that. Um, so, our opponent wanted a you you one of an NU battle now I I was not prepared for this I don't have a lot of NU Pokemon uh, on X and Y right now uh, yeah so I kind of have to throw together what I could out of what I have a lot of some of them are just straight up PU uh, so they may be a little bit outclassed but c'est la vie and um, our opponent is blazing Axel or is it flaming Axel sorry Axel one second it's Flaming Axel! I suck with names lately, what is even wrong with me? Yeah, so it's Flaming Axel, uh, he's got a YouTube and a Twitter, you should check them out, I'll put them in the link below. Uh, yeah, so we've been waiting a long time for this battle, well, in the last couple of days, we've had to delay it a lot, is what I mean. He is the live opponent I mentioned in yesterday's battle that, uh, that didn't show up for uh, quite a few hours. Uh, so yeah, so yeah, we've been waiting a long time for this battle, so let's get this started straight away. I'll go through with you right now what I am bringing. I am bringing a Grand Ball with Intimidate. It's a specially defensive Grand Ball I told you about before that you've seen before. We have BHM, guys. Analytic BHM. Uh, physically defensive, but with Calm Mind. So a bit of a mixed wallish type thing. Uh, we've got Frogadier. You know what this thing does. You don't even need me to tell you. You know what this thing does. We've got Sneasel with two priority moves. Fake Out, Ice Shard, and the Focus Sash there. Uh, it's also got Pursuit and uh, the Brick Break. A uh, nose pass. Uh, you've seen this one in action before as well. It's got Thunder Wave and Stealth Rocks, Volt Switch, and Ancient Power. And we've got the Shift Tree for Defog, Fake Out, Shenanigans. That's just about the basics of the team. You guys can you guys can pretty much guess uh, what all the rolls are and all that jazz. Okay, what have we got here? What have we got here? We've got Scary Source is what we've got. We've got Absolute Scary Source. Holy Shazba. Dusk Noir. Uh, is that in you? Really? Camera up, Swallow. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no, Swallop. Swallop. Rotom. Good old fashioned Rotom. And Gra no, Groucho is my Pokemon. And a Crocorock. And that is so weird because I was just preparing myself Crocodile for you, you. So yeah, coincidences are fun. So the, uh, the Crocorock's probably going to come out first. Or the camera up to try and get some rocks off, right? Am I right? But do you know what I want to do about that? Do you know what I want to do about that? I'm going to leave with Neo Raph. Going to leave with Neo Raph because it outspeeds basically everything here. It outspeeds everything other than the Swallow and the Crocorock. Maybe Rope. <laughs> oh god. I don't do NU that much, okay guys? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And when I do, it's normally with straight NU Pokemon, like not NFE and all that jazz. Uh, at least on, um, what's that thing called? Showdown. Showdown, yes. I don't do a lot of Wi-Fi and you, as you can probably tell. Yikes. Okay, come on. Aerosmith. Oh, I had a feeling it might be this guy. I had a feeling it might be this guy. Okay. Okay, friend. So you're going to protect. You are going to protect to get that toxic boost. That is a shame. That is a real shame. Oh, are you? Are you going to protect, friend? Please protect. Protect would be lovely. Protect would be nice. Yeah, there we go. There's the protect. But it failed. Wah, wah. But you still got poisoned, so you've got that nice and tasty guts boost, and the facade's going to come our way soon. Um, really should have written down your team. Really should have made that a thing. Really need to start doing that. Ah, <laughs> just going to T-Wave. No, don't T-Wave. Don't T-Wave. But Oh, no, 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 no. Of course, that's why I T-Wave. I T-Wave because I expected him to switch out. I'm so silly. I'm so silly. My brain is just not wired correctly, guys. I'm telling you, I had a thought, then I forgot the thought, and then I chastised myself for going to act on that thought. That was so weird. Yeah, I was hoping he was going to switch in, but not into this thing. Oh my god. At least I know it's an Intimidate Crocodile rock and not a Moxie Crocodile rock, and that is always good to know. That is good knowledge. So this thing's more than likely going to go for either Stealth Rocks or Earthquake, in my humble and honest opinion. With that being said, with that being said, Stealth Rocks or Earthquake, oh, it's tough, you know? I think I'm going to switch Churchill in. Now, part of me instinctively wants to just straight up uh, go into lock the shift tree, get a fake out off um, or a defog, depending on what he goes for. But, friends, but the problem with that, the problem with that is that Churchill here can take anything this Crocorock wants to dish out quite well, especially after an Intimidate. 
and then he can get a play rough off. So yeah, go on, Churchill, coming through. Come on, buddy. <sighs> Don't go for anything lame. Don't go for any craziness. Don't switch out. Just stay in. Stay in. Go for the rocks. It's cool. Rocks are fine. You can live with rocks. Stealth rocks. Here we go. Not bad. Okay. I see you, buddy. I see you. Uh, so yeah, I doubt you're going to have much for me. So let us just go for a choice banded stab. Play rough. In your face. Disgrace. Yeah, okay. What's going to come into this, though? What's going to come into this? Dust Noir? No, Swallow. Of course, Swallow. Why would I even question? Why would I even question? How much damage is this going to do? Probably not a lot, right? Oh, ho, 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 ho. it was a crit. I should have just gone for the EQ. That would have been the smart play. Definitely would have been the smart play. Okay, so he's obviously going to go for the Poison type move. We've got no Steel types. Massive oversight on our part. But I'm going to switch Navigator in. Because Navigator will be able to take what this thing wants to do quite well. Uh, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Then, Mind Froins, uh, he can also do that lovely little thing of Shazam! Psychic type move in your face. Disgrace. But we ain't going to go for no psychic type move, friends. And let me tell you for why. Because he's probably going to switch back into the Crocker Rock to take the fuck me. That did, that did not go according to plan. That did not go according to plan at all. But we get a nice free switch in right here. Now, I think Neil Rash should be able to take this thing on quite well. What do you think, guys? What do you think, guys? I'm thinking so. I'm also thinking Scold, but uh, but that thing, the the Taylo thing, Swallow even. <laughs> Ice beam. I don't even know how to feel about this right now. Come on, you can do it, Neil Rash. You're so powerful. I believe in you. Ah! <sighs> I love you, Neo Raph. I love you and your sexy ice beams. I really do. Oh man, I, you know I know he's powerful as hell, but I just I know Swallow is so thick, he's so chunky and goopy. You, you know you just turn the goop into frozen goop, which makes it harder and therefore able to smash you harder. So I got scared. I got scared. Okay, guys, forgive me. I am only human, mostly, sometimes. So what are you going to go for, buddy? Aerosmith. Yeah, thought so. Thought so. Are you going to go for another U-turn, though? I think you're probably going to go for another U-turn. But that's okay, because Groucho gives no craps. Groucho gives no craps. But you are going to U-turn. You're going to U-turn into the guy, into the thing, into the Crocorock, right? That's what you're going to do. That's what you're going to do. I don't know what to do about that, though. You are. You're going to U-turn, aren't you? A facade? Okay, this is good times, because now we can get up our own Stealth Rocks. That means that, holy monkeys, look how much damage that thing did. That was a resisted hit on an Eviolite. Eviolite nose pass. Can we just take a second here, guys? Holy crap. Okay, so we're going to put our own rocks up. Yummy, yummy. Now, the Crocker Rock's coming in. That is, that is completely, 100% guaranteed. I am sure of this. But these rocks will be nice anyway. You know, should be able to do some decent damage to that poison motherfucker right there. That's always nice. It's always nice when you get someone who's toxic but has a guts boost. A little bit more chip damage every time. Well, every time they switch in. It's always good. Okay, here comes the Rotom. What do you want to do to me, buddy? I might just stay in, you know? Might just stay in, go for the Ancient Power. Because really, this thing... I mean, Groucho has set up the rocks. That is his job. That is his main job. And anything else he does is, is ancillary, you know? It, it is a bonus. It is an extra. Oh, Groucho. Good game, buddy. Who are you going to send in? Somebody nice and slow would be good. <laughs> ah, this battle's making me nervous. I really I really should have said to him, sorry, dude, like, I don't really have an, an NU ready team, you know, on, on X and Y. Like, I don't have one that I'd be satisfied bringing to an NU battle. But, no. I just went for it. You know me, guys. Somebody challenged me, and I was like, yeah, screw it. You know what? We can make a team, so let's make a team. Might not be the best team. Might not be a well-rounded team. It might not even be all in the right tier. But, you know, it's fine. It's fine. God damn. Okay, so are we going to send Churchill in right now? We can send Churchill in and go for an earthquake. <sighs> That'd be nice. But then again, yeah, that thing come in. <sighs> I'm just going just gonna to send a Neora. If this thing's scarfed, it probably still won't outspeed. Will it? I don't think. I don't think it will. Okay, screw it. Scald. Scald. I'm scalding. 
Every day I'm scalding. Then at the next available opportunity, I'm going to switch lock in and I'm going to defog because these rocks are a real pain in my dick. Okay, who's this guy? Who you bringing out, buddy? Dusk Noir. Well, that's no fun for anyone, really, is it? Because this can take hits for days. But we do have Dark Pulse. We do have that yummy Dark Pulse. That's always nice. If we can get a burn on this thing, that would be divine. No, okay. Okay, I see you. Um, yeah, well, that was a neutral hit. This thing is lefties, though. That is no fun. Are you going to shadow sneak me? You're probably going to shadow sneak me, aren't you? You seem like a sneaky sort of guy. We don't have no normal types, though. No, we do not. No, we do not. Um, all right. All right, let me tell you what I'm going to do. Let me tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to switch Churchill in. Or am I? The Dark Pulse will probably KO, the Shadow Sneak won't. But what do I need Neo Rat for? Nope, nope, Churchill's coming in. Ah! Probably shouldn't have switched out, because this thing has life orb, we have no team recovery, and every little bit of chip damage it gets means less attacks. But, but, all we can do is just roll with the decision we just made and make the best of it. Please don't Willow. Please don't Willow. Please don't... Wow! I didn't think he would Willow because it was a special attacker that came in. Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me right now, my friend? He's probably going to expect the player off from beginning to swallow. He's probably going to do that. Probably going to do that. Let's hope he does that. Let's hope he does that. No, no, he stays in. He stays in. That was most unexpected. And now pain split. Wow, this is annoying. This is annoying. Ah, I hate stall. I hate no. I hate epic stall. Ah, oh, pain split. Toxic pain split. Willow. Ah, so fucking frustrating. Such a pain in my dick. Such a pain in my dick. Okay. With that being said, though, guys, now it's time for lock. Now it's time to get rid of the damn rocks, because they are pissing me right off, to be perfectly honest with you. TVPH, with you. Okay, the withdrawal's coming, not bad. What are you going into, though, buddy? Rotom! This Rotom is a ghost type, though. This Rotom is a ghost type, so we can't use Fake Out. We can use Knock Off, though. That's nice. That is nice. Uh, but... Oh, but if we defog, we get rid of our own rocks. No, I'm going to knock off. I'm going to straight up knock off. No, oh, what's that hidden power? That's ice. We can take one ice. Unless that's specs. Oh, we take it anyway! Not even bad. Not even bad. Good game, Rotom. Good game, buddy. We can't switch this guy out now. Because if we switch this guy out, then that is it. That, oh no, we, we don't have to, of course. I'm such a double stilt skin sometimes. Yes, I am. Okay, so I think the swallow is going to come in. I think the swallow is going to come in. I want the dog in the ass. I'm going to switch Sneasel in because then we can get the. Uh, yeah, here we go, here we go. You are going to switch out, though. You're definitely going to switch out. Am I right? Am I right? You won't risk it. No way will you risk it, friend. Surely, 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 right, if this guy's real, if this guy is real, he will stay in and he will go for like quick attack or something, you know, or outspeed and go for, no, he won't outspeed, no, he won't outspeed, Sneasel is fast, he won't outspeed, you sure? Yeah, so if he's real, he'll go for like a quick attack or something, if he's not real, he'll switch into, no, wait, I got that backwards, if he, if he is real, he'll switch out. If he's not real, oh shit. I don't know what to do right now, guys. I think I think the Dust Noir is probably coming. Pursuit! Pursuit! No! Shouldn't have pursued it! Oh, he protects. He's protecting the scout. He's protecting the scout. I think he was expecting the fake out, maybe. You're just gonna get more... You're just gonna get more toxic damage, though, dude. Uh, Wow, a teeny tiny amount of toxic damage. That is, that is lame. That is, but well, now he knows we're going for pursuit as well. 
so he probably won't switch. Will he? He'll probably go for the quick attack. Now he'll probably go for the quick attack. That is my... Oh, the... You know what he'll do? You know what I think he'll do? I think he might U-turn. Screw it, gonna have to ice shard, really, aren't we, guys? That's how this is gonna have to go. Can this KO? Can't this should be able to KO. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. See, I should have predicted... The last time I predicted this thing to come in, should have switched knee suddenly straight away. Straight up. But I derped. I done derped. What is even wrong with me sometimes, you guys? I don't even know. Oh, this thing's intimidate, isn't it? Ah, nine. That is not good. That is, that is not good. Do you know what? I would rather. I would rather switch out. I would rather switch out into Churchill right now. I would rather switch out into Churchill. Either get KO'd or take some damage and be able to intimidate this thing myself. Uh, and then, of course, we can get our own intimidate off on this thing. Intimidate this thing. Uh, get our attack back with Sneasel. Switch him in. Take a bit of stealth box damage. Ice shard. Hope for the best. It's pretty much all we can do right now. Excuse me. Now, do you see that, guys? It might be a defensive Crocorock, but this thing is not physically defensive. And look how well he took that hit. Gramble OP. I'm telling you. Great mom. Alright, do you know what? Screw it. I'm going to send in Raph. Raph's coming in first. Raph is coming in first. I've got a good feeling about Raph. He needs to just power through some opponents. Just power through the team while that life orb damage just drains his HP. And then, suddenly, he'll be KO'd. And he'll get to rest. He'll get to chill. But that Crocorock is down. That is nice. That is the Intimidator and the Defensive Mon down. Which is Vondabar. We need to get rid of that thing anyway. Um, although, hold on. Who have we got left? We've got Raph left. And... Who is the other guy? Oh, yes, Neasel. Right, so we do have an, an okay range of type coverage. On top of that, we've got two fast mon, both of whom have super effective moves against this guy right here. I am, however, quite worried that he's going to shadow sneak and we won't be able to take that. It's going to go for Dark Pulse anyway. Please don't shadow sneak. You don't shadow sneak! Okay, this might KO. This, this should KO. Right? Yeah! That was tight, man. I seriously did not think that was going to KO for a second there because uh, he seemed to have a little bit more. HP than I was expecting to take away. Although I'm not sure how much a Life Orb uh, Frogadier does to a Dust Noir. I mean, I don't know if it's specially defensive. That thing, that thing probably was specially defensive, I have a feeling. Maybe I'm crazy. Now, this, <laughs> this camera up, even if it's scarfed, surely, correct me if I'm wrong, most awesome of folk, but this thing should not outspeed, right? This Humpty Dumpty of Doom should not be able to outspeed us, so this Skull should be enough? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Right, be the... No? Are we? Can we? Alrighty then. I honestly, not going to lie to you guys, thought we were going to lose that for a sizable amount of time. A really, really large amount of time I thought we were going to lose that for. That was a good game, Raymond. Good game. Um, wait. Blazing, flaming, blazing, flaming, blazing, flaming. I'm going to go for flaming. Flaming Axel, good game Raymond, aka Flaming Axel. That was, uh, that was, I'm gonna save that just in case the recording screws up. But yeah, thank you for the battle. Um, he actually approached me asking for a battle, which was really nice, because he's got a higher sub count than me. And, and whenever someone who's obviously been in the business longer than you just somehow knows about you and approaches you and, and wants to battle you, you know, that kind of makes you feel good. You know, it makes you feel like maybe, uh, you know, maybe, you know, somebody appreciates you as a battler and thinks you're okay. I know I make some questionable plays, and I know I have some strange ass moves on my Pokemon sometimes, but. I like to do things that, sometimes I do them because it's straight up stupid and I need to learn more. Uh, sometimes I do it because I just like to try out things that are weird. Not necessarily weird and will work, but weird and will be fun and or surprising. But a lot of the time it's because I'm just straight up derping and being a double stiltskin. But yeah, anyway, thank you for the game, Raymond, and thank you guys for stopping by. If you enjoyed, leave a like, I guess, but what I would like you to do above all else is to leave me a comment down below and let me know what you did like, let me know what you didn't like, why you did or didn't like it, and how you would improve the channel, how you would improve what I do with it, what you'd like to see brought to it. I love you guys. Have a sizz-awesome day. Don't forget to be awesome. I feel like I stole that from somewhere. Goodbye.